orange bags. What are they doing? They are flying in the sky. They are flying. <laughs> they are in bags. They are going to the doctor. <laughs> All right. Very good. All right, let's look at the next picture. Ooh. Hmm. So, first question. First question is, what do you see? What do you see? Hmm. Wow. What do you see? I see a lot of birds. Okay. So maybe they are birds. Let's see. And we say a lot. Excellent. A lot of birds. Hmm. Okay. I see a lot of birds and a person. Excellent job. So we say a person, one person, many people, a person. Maybe bats. Good. Okay. So let's see. Are they birds or are they bats? <coughs> Excuse me. Maybe. Let's see if there is one that is very clear. Ooh. Like I see this one. And it looks kind of like maybe like Batman. Right? <laughs> so maybe they are bats. Mmm, so I think so. A lot of birds or bats. And you said a cave opening. So maybe in here, a lot of birds or bats. And you said a cave opening. So maybe in here, maybe this is a cave. Good, I see a cave. And you said opening. Very good. This is the opening. Opening. I see a coronavirus null patient. Maybe so, right? Maybe coronavirus came from bats. So, I don't know. Let's find out. Let's, <laughs> let's read. So, a woman makes noise as she chases bats away from an electric utility tower in Pa'an, Kayan State, Myanmar, on March 1st, 2020. Ooh. Okay, so we were right. They are bats. And I cannot hear this picture, so I don't know what she is doing. Maybe she is walking. But here it says she makes noise. So the person who took the photo, the photographer, said she made noise. So she is making noise. Well, she chases bats away. So she is chasing them away from a utility tower. Now we maybe we cannot see the utility tower here, but now, I see something new. So if we look, we can look here. And maybe you can see this is a lighter color. So it looks like this here is a cliff. And maybe this is like a city down below, maybe. And the astronaut says maybe what she is holding is making the noise. Maybe so. Maybe she is banging or maybe she has some uh, like a radio playing music. So she is making noise, getting the bats away from an electric tower in Myanmar. <laughs> Very good. Awesome. And let's find that on the map. So Myanmar, um, we also sometimes say Burma, so Myanmar or Burma, and uh, I don't know where this city is, Pa on Kayan State, Myanmar. So here's Myanmar, and that's where she is. Wow.
<laughs> All right. I like that picture. I think it's cool. Okay. Any questions about this one? We'll go to the next one. Hmm. Okay. So, oh, let's not read yet. First, what do you see? What do you see? All right. I'll write our question up here. Oops. What do you see? A man and woman. Excellent. I see a man, one man, and a woman. Very good. And it's raining. Yeah, it is. It's raining. And what do they have? What do they have? Hmm. They have excellent umbrella. Very good. Oh, and I am learning some Russian. Except I don't know how to read it, but thank you. So they are holding an umbrella. Excellent. All right. So we said they are holding an umbrella. Excellent sentence. So it is an umbrella. So remember, in English, every one thing has a, an, or the. One pencil, a pencil. One umbrella, an umbrella. Because it starts with A, E, I, O, U. Excellent. They are holding an umbrella. Very good. Oh, okay. Zon, zontik. Zontik? Zontik. Zontik. Thank you. Okay, they are holding an umbrella, and it is raining. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. I see a man and a woman. Very good. Okay, so let's read. And maybe they are walking. Maybe they are walking. I don't know. And I also see... Oh, in Portuguese. Oh, yay, Portuguese, Russian. Thanks, guys. And girls, guys, girls, thank you. Guarda chuva. Guarda chuva. Excellent. Thank you. I also see a light. I see a light here. The light can say the light is shining on them. The light is shining. Like the sun, you can see the sun is shining. The light is shining. Hmm. So let's read. Who are these people? What are they do? Who are these people? What are they doing? So Britons, Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex, and Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, arrived to attend the Endeavor Fund Awards at Mansion House in London, England, on March fifth, two thousand twenty. Yeah, you're right, they are in London. So this is Prince Harry and Meghan, Meghan Markle. Um, so they recently moved to Canada and now they are in London for this event, Endeavor Fund Awards in London, England. Excellent, very good, but maybe from the back I don't know who they are. They are a man and a woman. Very good. I didn't know it was them. <laughs> Excellent. All right. They are raining. The light is shining. They are holding an umbrella. Awesome. All right. Let's look at the next picture. Oh, we can find London on the map first. We go over here. Here is London. All right. We are going everywhere. America, South America, China, South Korea, Myanmar, London. Okay. What's next? Ooh. Ah. Trying to have no words. Okay. Just the picture. No words. What do you see? Hmm. Maybe you know who this is. Maybe you don't know who this is. But what do you see? Mm. OK. 
Okay, okay, I see a man. Maybe this is a man. And this is a crowd. Excellent. So, a crowd. And a crowd equals many people. Good. I see a crowd or many people. Very good. And the astronaut says maybe a political rally. And why do you think it is maybe a political rally? What do you see that makes you think that? Ah, okay, and Vladimir, welcome, hello, hello Vladimir, says, a light in the end of the tunnel, ooh, maybe it does, it looks like a tunnel, right, there's like a tunnel here, and there's a light, very good, and a crowd of people pressed closely together, awesome, yes, they are very close together, and the astronaut says there are signs in the crowd. Okay, so there are signs here. So maybe it is something for political, a political rally. Awesome. Great, guys. Okay, so that's great. And what time of day is it? What time is it? I think... I think we are outside because I think these are street lights. They are on the street. I think. Maybe not. And it is night. Or it is dark. It is night or it is dark inside. So, are we ready? Are we ready to read? Let's read. Oh, okay. Democratic presidential candidate, Senator Elizabeth Warren, speaks during a primary election night rally at Eastern Market in Detroit, Michigan, on March 3rd, 2020. Warren suspended her campaign on March 5th. Okay, so this is actually a woman. <laughs> it's hard to tell. It's the back of her. So this is a woman. Her name is Elizabeth Warren. Elizabeth Warren. It's always, it's always night in Detroit. <laughs> it's not, it's not always night in Detroit. But is that a joke about Detroit? I don't know that joke. <laughs> Okay, Detroit. Yeah, she's in Detroit. So let's let's look up who is she first. She is Elizabeth Warren. So this is her. Oh, let's look at a picture. This is her, and she wanted to be the president of the United States. So in the United States. There are two big political parties. There are Republicans and Democrats. So now the Republican is the President, Trump, and there are many Democrats who want to. So Elizabeth Warren is one of them. Bernie Sanders, um, Joe Biden, and um, I, that's really all right now. So uh, we will see some of them later on in the next pictures. So right now in America, the Democrats are choosing their one person to go against Trump to be president. So Warren wanted to be president. So she was speaking, but some states have started to vote for the Democrats. So in America, there are 50 states, and some of them started to vote for Democrats. And now, because Elizabeth Warren did not get a lot of votes, she decided 
that she is not going to keep trying to be president. So she said, I'm done, right? I'm, I'm not trying anymore. So now, really, there are just two, right? There are just two, Sanders and Biden. So one of them will go against Trump to be the president, and that will be in November. In November, we Americans will vote, do we want Trump or do we want the Democrat, which is either Sanders or Biden? So this is her. She decided on March 5th, a couple days ago, that she will not continue because people are not voting for her. Um, so yes, Vladimir says Obama, who was Obama, Democrat or Republican? Obama was Democrat. Democrat. Yeah. Good question. So now in America, we are voting for the next Democrat who will then be against Trump to be president. So first we need to choose who, who it will be. Uh, so it's not Warren. Very good. And then you said <laughs> Detroit is always dark, right? It is always night in Detroit. <laughs> it's not. But let's look at Detroit, and she is at Eastern Market. 